Hi, thank you for choosing to watch this video. So whether you are feeling quite hopeless or helpless at the moment, or maybe you're just looking for a bit more peace in your life, for whatever reason you've, you've been led to press, click on to start watching this live video, I just pray that the words that I share, a lot of which will be from the Holy Bible, from the, from the inspired word of God. Hey, bro. Hey, I'm... All right, I've just gone... I've just gone live. It's such a quick call to share my work. That's why I sent you the picture. Ah, okay. Yeah, no, I, I presume so. Yeah, I'm just... Yeah, my last night is tomorrow, and then I'm on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Right, we'll be doing things together. Wonderful, yeah. Yes, please, yeah. Is that okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm just on a live now. I've only just started, so yeah, I'll, yeah, you I'll go, get back. You, go. You, you, go. You, you keep the... How do you say? Keep carrying the, the torch. Yes, that's yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a relay. It's like a relay. You take, you carry the baton. Okay? <laughs> yeah, God bless you. God thank bless thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Sorry about that. I just, um, I just pray that, yeah, that these words that I share, I'm going to do a, a reading of the hall of Isaiah 55. And it is the invitation to the Lord's salvation. So you may be hearing these words for the first time in your life. You may be familiar with these words. Wherever you are, our Father meets us wherever we are. And there is no height, nor depth, nor any other creature that will be able to separate you from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those that are crushed in spirit. And God hasn't given you a spirit of fear but of power, of love, and of a sound mind. And our Father in heaven, hallowed be his name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. He created you, he formed you, he has plans for you plans for good and not for disaster to give you a future and a hope. You are loved by Jesus. Then you will know the truth and the truth will set you free. Because before the beginning of time, you have been chosen to be free, and who the sun sets free is free indeed. This is Isaiah 55. I just pray that the Holy Spirit will be upon you, allowing you to receive these words, to believe the word of God, and to be experiencing something quite beautiful inside of you. Isaiah 55 from verse 1. Is anyone thirsty? Come and drink, even if you have no money. Come, take your choice of wine or milk. It's all free. Why spend your money on food that does not give you strength? Why pay for food that does you no good? Listen to me and you will eat what is good. You will enjoy the finest food. Come to me with your ears wide open. Listen and you will find life. 
I will make an everlasting covenant with you. I will give you all the unfailing love I promised to David. See how I used him to display my power among the peoples. I made him a leader among the nations. You also will command nations you do not know. And peoples unknown to you will come running to obey. Because I, the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, have made you glorious. Seek the Lord while you can find him. Call on him now while he is near. Let the wicked change their ways and banish the very thought of doing wrong. Let them turn to the Lord that he may have mercy on them. Yes, turn to our God, for he will forgive generously. My thoughts are nothing like your thoughts, says the Lord. And my ways are far beyond anything you could imagine. For just as the heavens are higher than the earth, so my ways are higher than your ways, and my thoughts higher than your thoughts. The rain and snow come down from the heavens and stay on the ground to water the earth. They cause a grain to grow, producing seed for the farmer and bread for the hungry. It is the same with my word. I send it out and it always produces fruit. It will accomplish all I want it to and it will prosper everywhere I send it. You will live in joy and peace. The mountains and hills will burst into song and the trees of the field will clap their hands. Where once there were thorns, cypress trees will grow. Where nettles grew, myrtles will sprout up. These events will bring great honour to the Lord's name. They will be an everlasting sign of his power and love. Our Father is waiting. He's waiting for his children to come back home. He's waiting with open arms. Jesus is knocking on the door. And Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today and forever. God bless you and protect you. And may his face shine upon you. Agape.